Good evening, everyone. I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me. And I want to give a shout out to somebody that bought me a cup of coffee. Yeah, it's almost 9 p.m. my time. Yeah, definitely need the coffee. Thank you so much. There was a magnitude 4.3 earthquake there on the big island of Hawaii near Kilauea uh, Volcano. They're saying it's near Volcano, according to USGS. It happened about two and a half hours ago. 399 people said they felt this earthquake, and it was about 15 and a half miles below sea level and felt across the entire island. Look at that. Let me bring this in a little bit. Over on the uh, north uh, point there, intensity level 4. They've been having some fires there. Let's see, uh, another one, intensity level 4. I'm not going to try and pronounce it. That one I can. Mountain View, intensity level 4. Pahoa, intensity level 4. That would be close to uh, Hilo. Uh, let's see, another one, intensity level 4. So that was pretty significant earthquake. Intensity level 4 means it was felt indoors by many, outdoors by a few. At night, some may have been woken up, but there is a report on EMSC that it did wake them up. Um, dishes, windows, doors would have been rattling. Automobiles rock noticeably. Um, down south a little bit by Volcano, it says, this is the first earthquake I felt that woke me up. Mountain View, I just showed you that, said it was a good-sized jolt. Another one from Mountain View said two to three seconds of mild shaking. And a deep rumbling in Fern Acres, strongest I've felt in seven months. Wow. Uh, two mile jolts, jolts in Hilo. Um, hardest jolt and rumble. Neighbors calling and texting, asking, asking if I felt it. Um, let's see, same location here. Quick jolt here in the lower Paradise Park. Got the dog's attention, for sure. Another one says, uh, HPP. Heard it from Lahani. Uh, thought something fell. Um, Pahoa. Sorry if I'm pronouncing these names wrong. It came as a quick jolt and shook my windows. Um, another one says, big shake here at 1.37 p.m. Okay, shaking lasted several seconds with two separate jolts. And then another one says, fast jolt that caught our instant attention. So, 1.37 p.m. local time there in Hawaii. 18 earthquakes within the last 24 hours, the largest being this magnitude 4.3. Yeah, there's been a lot there by Volcano. Let me bring this in, see if it'll light up. Yeah, they're in the crater, and we got, what, 2.7, a 2.2, a 2.0, 2.0, 2.0, 2.1, 1.8, and a 1.9. More than likely, uh, yeah, the, the plume that's coming up, it's clearing its throat. For more magma to come into the system. The last update they have for that area was on August 8th, about five days ago. And it says it's not erupting. No significant changes have been observed at the summit or in either rift zones in the past week. Over the past week, seismicity has continued at low levels, but with a slight increase in the number of events compared to previous weeks yeah i think it's clearing its throat getting ready for another eruption summit tilt meters recorded minor net inflation over the past week uh, sulfur dioxide so2 emissions from the summit remain low the most recent so2 emission rates of approximately uh 121 tons per day that's a lot yeah, I'd like to go there, but breathing in all that 
toxic gases. Yeah, a lot of people there have breathing problems because of the constant, uh, yeah, gases. And you think of um, Polly's hair. Yeah. Let's see. Their live Vogue um, gift that they have, it doesn't look very bad at all there. Yeah, let me bring it out a little bit. Yeah, see that? It's just maybe it could be that it's not working properly, but there's Hilo. Here's a webcam from Holly Mamu looking down into the crater. This here would be a thermal image, and it doesn't look really bad. We got some spots, and then over here gives you the temperature. Another image from the north um, west rim, and up over here they got the time and the date. And this is all from today, and then we got another image. Looks like we got some heat over here on the left. You can see the the gas is coming up. And then I'll pull it over for you so you can see more of it. And another image of the crater floor. You can see the gases over here around the uh, rim on the left. It looks out like over here on the east there is a small community. Uh, did you have damage? I'd like to know that. Uh, we got Hawaii Forest Farms. Yeah. I hope everyone's okay. I hope they got everything secure. I hope you have a bug out bag. It's just an indication that sometime in the future, once again, it will erupt. So what are your thoughts? Put your comments down below. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. As always, be prepared. Please stay safe. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you.